Okay, I'm outside on November 19th, which is a Wednesday, 2015. Hooking up the uh, wind turbine. I've got uh, a friend of mine who brought oil, a drill stem pipe that's 32 feet long. There it is. I had to chop off the end of it. And a good friend of mine, awesome friend. He took this three inch pipe with a 1.2920 OD filed it down, turned it down really nice here, and I pounded this into this pipe, which the drill stem pipe happened to be just the right two inch ID. So it went in there really good. There's about nine inches of pipe in there. I'm going to drill a hole here, a couple of holes probably just to be sure it ain't going to move, but I'm sure it ain't going to move. And so I'm going to do that and grind it flat, drill a couple of holes in it, and then over here is the wind turbine. And I got it tied down so the wind don't blow it and spin it while well, I got it on its assembly post. This all comes from Missouri Wind and Solar. And I've got two 250 watt solar panels right there. And if you look on the back, it displays what their capacities are. Let me see if I can get that in here. There it is right there. And max power at STC, 250 volts, etc., etc. There's all the uh, stats for each panel. And what I plan to do to this drill stem, 32 foot, just put it on the back of a house over there, grind it. I beat on it here on the end a little bit, but I'll just clean that up. I'll drill about two holes here, put a couple of bolts through it just to make sure it don't move. It's in there very tight. I use this uh, kind of like a sledgehammer to pound it in. And the help, the cat didn't help me at all. Over and out. Hi, I just thought I'd end it with my little kitty. This is itty bitty, but when it, she gets bigger, what do we call her then? But she's itty bitty right now. Still itty bitty. Anyway, thanks Cephas for this pipe here, down here. and. You did a great job here, and I just got to finish it up. And over here, I'll show you really quickly on these brackets, these locking collars. There's one locking collar right here that's going to go on that shiny part of that pipe. And another locking collar is going to go in this space right between here and here. Another locking collar on that other pipe. Then this will freely turn. I'll grease it up. I painted it, I'll file the paint away so it's got good ground, and that's about it. Get it up in the air, and I'll continue with some other videos later.